All right, hi friends of golfers, just working on a little wrist work here. Uh, let's see, hit a seven iron. See my numbers here, good. This is uh, one thing I love about uh, TrackMan is the um, optimizer, so I can look at it and kind of see where my numbers are. So I don't love my path getting out here. Um, I do like that, you know, if you've been watching my videos for some time now, you'd see probably months and months ago, I was having trouble with my club face. Um, so I'm, I like how I'm doing this better now. Um, I'd like to see this more around a four, so I don't have as much curvature on shots. Um, I'm just looking at some numbers here. So you have um, swing plane, 56 six and a half for a seven iron. Okay, so club speed, I, you know, I want to be a little higher than that. Um, height, you know, hitting a hundred is perfect for me. 3.3A, after I'm good with that, my launch angle. So about 16 with a seven iron. Um, so mine is about 32 degrees. So that's perfect. Half is awesome. Um, and ball speed obviously is really good. Uh, spin axis negative 5.4. So if we look at it here, you'll see it drew a bit. It should have. And it's hard to tell from that one, but if you look at, let's see, uh, this one here. Yeah, you can see it. A little draw there. So it's out there because you look at face angles of five. So it's going to start pretty close to that angle, and then due to the face angle being close to the path, I got my draw in there, so on the right side of the green. But let's take a look real quick at the swing. Um, let's see what I am doing here. So if I've eradicated any of my uh, faults I don't like. Okay, draw a line here. And I have sometimes trouble with early extension, so I'm going to check it. Finger's not working too great on this uh, mouse pad here. I'm just going to put it like right there. Okay. Well, let's kind of just play through this. I mean, ideally, I'm probably going to come inside <laughs> just because the way I am. Oh, wow, that's really good for me. I still would like to see this riding it up more. Why? Because my club had riding up the uh, uh, plane there of the club. Why? Because then it would be pointed at center field instead of a little bit out to right, okay, where it is right now. Um, let's see, top position. I mean, if you look at what that club face would be right there, it's exactly matching my forearm. Um, elbows, I like. Uh, you know, I work on that so they try not to have much separation. Uh, bring it down. Obviously, I'm swinging in doubt, so it's going to be behind here. So for me, this is okay to have the club where I am. Others, I'd say you have to have the club face more close to match your back. This is what I don't like. That early extension right there, I got to work on that a bit. Yeah, I would have cleared more if I didn't, you know. I mean, I still smacked it, but I, I want to see more. Yeah, and then just the way it exits. So I got, I got just like everybody else, I got <laughs> work to do on my swing too. I never practice um, because uh, I usually don't have the time, uh, but I want to. I would like to get, a, get my swing back in order. Um, so maybe I'll make a commitment to all you folks that I'll do it today, starting today. Okay, thank you. Appreciate you following me. Okay, golf fans, thanks for watching. I just want a quick follow-up here. So if you watched my last video, uh, you know that uh, I, uh, I didn't like the way my club exits, okay? I like to see my hands on this club head. And, uh, I'm just going to show you this one right here, how I do a better job of it. Now, this is just, I take a real close swing here. Just to practice, guys, this is how we do it. 67 miles per hour, okay? 25 miles under the moment of this. So just come up here. I'm down to it. What am I trying to do? Exit left. I want to see my hands gone. So see how I rotate better and stay back? That's what I'm going for right here. Okay? And that's what you won't see as well. In the so we want to see those hands exiting and the club still out there. So that's the goal. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.